Hello students, today I will show you how to create stock items. Not only stock items, stock items with opening stock means quantity, purchase rate, sales rate and closing rate. Closing rate means standard rate. It will be same with purchase rate. Okay, purchase rate and closing rate same. Sales rate is different. Actually, purchase rate this is 9, suppose uh, for example, this is 9 rupees and this is uh, 12 rupees this is sell rate with extra profit okay so purchase rate and closing rate is same so how to create the stock item with opening balance I'll show you now master go to item product then product okay now click add product code Product code is this is the code. Product code is PR1. PR1. Description. Description is bulb. Okay. Now tab. Service item no. Okay. Purchase unit. Use tab and click OK. Okay. Then purchase unit. Purchase unit is PCS. Just type PCS. Use tab. Stock unit and sales unit. Digital blocks fill it with automatically now sell this one sell sell means sales rate for bulb sales rate is 12 and part um, buy means purchase buy is 9 okay this is the purchase rate and sales rate put here the sales rate is 12 and buy is 9 purchase rate is 9 then move here sales account link sales account with this stock item okay because you have to link this sales account purchase account sales return account purchase return account ledgers with every stock items neither you cannot find any stock item at the time of entry of any type of invoice so at the time of creation this stock items you have to link these four ledgers the price is the same for all stock item sales account select sales account from here Yes, sales account here. Now sales return. <coughs> sales return account and the purchase account. This one is purchase account. Sorry, the purchase account. And for purchase return account. Purchase return account. And this one. Yeah, click OK. So type the product code PR1 description bulb. Partition it type PCS and use tab. Next two box is fill up automatically. Link sales purchase and sales return purchase return ledger and click save. Next item PR2 that is tube quantity. You have to put quantity at a different way. Okay. Now just put purchase rate sales rate here. Tube is 38 rupees 38 purchase rate and sales rate is 44. Okay. That is tube. PCS use tab. Then the sell rate. Sell rate is 44. And buy rate is 38. Okay now go to sales we're selecting sales account ledger this is sales account ledger next one is sales return this one next is purchase account you can use if one to search your recruitment ledger from this 
ledger list this is purchase account or you can click magnify icon purchase return this is purchase return account okay now save it spear 3 the next th third one is a fan 500 and 625 okay fan sales rate is 625 625 and the next one is 500 500 is purchase rate yes it is now move to the leisure mapping area sales account yes sales account and sales return next is uh, purchase account purchase return account next is PR4 Twitter the sales rate is for heater it is 750 750 and buy rate is and 875 sorry it is sales rate 875 it's not it is not 750 it is 875 875 and next it is 750 is it yes it is <coughs> now the ledger mapping area sales account select sales account and next sales return then purchase account and then purchase return purchase return and this header it is complete and last one is geezer okay geezer pr5 yes pr5 geezer sell rate is 1350 and the buy is Sell it in. Purchase account and purchase return account. Okay. All matching is complete. Sales account, sales return, purchase account and purchase return. And the uh, description. In the description put the stock item name purchase unit pcs stock unit pcs sales unit pcs put the sales rate and buy rate here buy rate means purchase rate okay now save it now the quantity escape to close it now the quantity how to put this quantity go to master then opening balances okay also again go to master then opening balances then product master opening balances and products click here select first product bulb click add document number document number is document number is one okay don't use any class use tab use the tab again and quantity quantity is 1000 this one 1000 okay and the uh, rate click here ok and the rate is 9 put the closing rate here now save it check the value value is same ok save 
next select next click ok and use escape single time single time then select new stock item click add doc number is 2 to the class use tab use tab then quantity quantity is 250 piece and the click here ok close it just and rate is 38 use tab tab and save it then again the same process follow the same process use escape single time then select new product click add document number is 3 document is like serial number nothing else you have to skip this class and date and quantity quantity is so fan yes fan quantity is 50 piece okay you stab and close it just click ok it will be closed rate rate is fan rate is here is 500 sorry it is 500 okay you stab and tab then save it okay the next one is hitter sorry use escape single time then click hitter then click add Docker number is 4 skip that class and date then quantity for hitter is 20 piece click ok then the rate is 750 use tab and save it use single escape then click gizzard the last one and click add then docker number is 5 skip class and date then quantity is quantity yes is quantity quantity is 15 piece click ok rate rate is 1100 1100 okay and save it okay students so this is a process how to create stock items with its opening balances use escape to close this dialog box okay so students this was our topic for today Stock items creation with purchase sales and closing rate. Today's class is over.